Hi, I'm Dr. James Beck, Chief Scientific Officer of the Parkinson's Foundation. Receiving a Parkinson's diagnosis can be overwhelming. This life-changing news can leave you unsure of your next steps. It is important to take time to understand Parkinson's and how it can impact you and your loved ones. While it may be confusing to navigate at first, know that it is possible to live well with Parkinson's. Today, I will discuss what Parkinson's disease is, offer guidance on finding support after your diagnosis, and share practical tips for living well and effectively managing PD. Whether you've been recently diagnosed or know someone who has, this information can help guide you through the first steps in your journey with Parkinson's. Parkinson's disease is a progressive neurological disorder that affects the whole brain, but is best known for the gradual loss of certain brain cells that produce dopamine. When the brain loses these cells and dopamine production drops, it becomes more difficult to move. The classic symptoms of Parkinson's are slowness of movement, also called bradykinesia, stiffness or rigidity, a tremor at rest that can initially appear in the hand or foot, and balance or gait issues. These symptoms are called the motor symptoms of Parkinson's, and they are the ones that we can see. Other Parkinson's symptoms are ones we cannot see easily and are called non-motor symptoms. These include a loss of smell, sleep issues, constipation, or anxiety and depression, among many others. Together, these symptoms, due to the brain changes of Parkinson's, can impact how one thinks, feels, and moves. In the US, nearly 1 million people are living with Parkinson's disease, and about 90,000 people each year are diagnosed. Scientists believe that a combination of genetic and environmental factors are the cause of PD. Genetics cause about 10 to 15% of all PD. In the other 85 to 90% of cases, the specific cause is unknown. While there's no cure yet for Parkinson's, there are many treatments available that can help manage symptoms. If you or a loved one has been diagnosed with Parkinson's, we recommend that you work with a neurologist to tailor treatments to your symptoms and your goals. Treatment options include medication, exercise, lifestyle changes such as healthy eating, and in some cases, surgery. Since most Parkinson's symptoms are caused by a lack of dopamine in the brain, many Parkinson's drugs are aimed at restoring this dopamine loss either by temporarily replacing dopamine or mimicking the action of dopamine. These types of drugs are called dopaminergic medications. They generally help reduce muscle rigidity, improve the speed and coordination of movement, and lessen tremors. The mainstay of dopamine replacement therapy is a drug called levodopa carbidopa. Starting healthy habits early can make a big difference in managing Parkinson's. Eating a balanced diet is key, so try to eat foods that support your brain and overall health. Things like fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, and lean proteins. Also, be sure to drink plenty of fluids to stay hydrated. Getting enough sleep is also important for managing PD. Sleep recharges our brains and our bodies while boosting mental wellness. People with Parkinson's, like all others, should aim to get seven to eight hours of sleep each night and maintain a consistent sleep schedule. Exercise is essential to managing PD and can control the appearance of many PD symptoms. Activities like walking, yoga, or dancing can improve flexibility and strength and coordination. If you're just starting out, try to make exercise a regular part of your day and talk to your doctor or physical therapist about what kinds of exercises are best for you. For people with PD, participation in clinical trials can allow researchers to study the biological and clinical changes of PD that occur over time. Trials often offer a structured treatment plan and close monitoring by specialists. Additionally, contributing to studies early can help accelerate the discovery of better therapies and improve diagnostic tools. For those who've been newly diagnosed, these first few years following a Parkinson's diagnosis are an optimal time to participate in research studies. In the early stages of PD, people may not yet be taking Parkinson's medications or experiencing significant symptoms. This often makes them ideal candidates for clinical trials for potential new treatments that may not yet be widely available and to test new ways to stop or slow the disease. Finding the right healthcare team can make a big difference in managing your Parkinson's. The first step is to find a neurologist near you. If possible, we recommend seeing a neurologist who has deep experience with Parkinson's, either through a large number of PD patients in their clinic or through specialized training in movement disorders. An experienced neurologist will understand the complexities of Parkinson's and can help guide your treatment. During your first appointment, your doctor will probably ask about your symptoms and medical history and they may do a physical exam to see how your body is moving. It's also a great time to ask questions about treatments, about medications, and options on how to effectively manage your symptoms. It is a good idea to bring a family member or friend with you to the appointment to help take notes or even ask questions. For help finding a neurologist or movement disorder specialist near you, please call the Foundation's helpline. Living with Parkinson's can sometimes feel isolating, but there are many ways to find support. It's important to talk to your family and friends when you're ready about what you're experiencing and how you're feeling. If they understand what Parkinson's is and how it affects you, 
they'll be more capable to offer emotional support. You can also join a support group where you can talk to others who are living with PD. There are local and online groups, so you don't have to go through this alone. It can be comforting to know that there are other people out there who understand what you're going through and can offer encouragement and advice from their own experiences. And please recognize that you are not alone. The Parkinson's Foundation is here for you at every stage of your journey. There are resources, support, and a community here to help. Together, we can achieve better lives for all who live with PD. For more information about Parkinson's disease, managing symptoms, and finding support, visit parkinson.org forward slash newly diagnosed.